What if your plane turned into a convertible mid-flight? Sounds like a scene from a movie, right? This actually happened in 1988. It was a year that aviation history would never forget. Aloha Airlines Flight 243 was flying between Hilo and Honolulu when, without warning, the roof tore off. Imagine the sheer terror. Passengers were exposed to the open sky at incredible altitudes with nothing but their seatbelts holding them in. The pressure drop was immediate but everyone stayed calm. The pilots? They had nerves of steel. True heroes. They managed to safely land the plane in just 13 minutes, saving almost everyone on board. Amazingly, 89 out of 90 people on board survived this harrowing ordeal. The only casualty was a flight attendant who was standing in the aisle at the time. The cause? Metal fatigue. It turned out that years of exposure to the salty, humid air had weakened the plane's fuselage, making it vulnerable. The aftermath was intense. The National Transportation Safety Board (NTSB) launched a thorough investigation. They discovered that the aircraft had undergone multiple pressurization cycles which contributed to the metal fatigue. As a result, airline safety regulations got a major overhaul. Regular and more thorough inspections became mandatory, focusing on areas prone to wear and tear. The FAA introduced new rules requiring airlines to perform detailed inspections on older aircraft, especially those operating in corrosive environments. So the next time you fly remember those safety measures are there for a reason. They are the result of lessons learned from past incidents.